Have you ever heard about the hacker who saved the internet? A question that for many might seem like a paradox. After all, aren't hackers the villains of the digital world, the ones who wreak havoc and disruption? Well, not always. Sometimes they use their skills to protect, to guard and to save. This is the story of one such individual, a mysterious hero whose actions reverberated through the world. The internet, a vast interconnected network, has become an integral part of our lives. It's our gateway to knowledge, a platform for communication, a tool for business, and so much more. A world without it seems unimaginable. But what if one day this crucial lifeline was threatened? What if a malicious virus was set to spread across this global network, causing unprecedented chaos and destruction? This isn't a hypothetical scenario. It's a frightening reality that we faced not too long ago. A reality where a global virus known as the Melissa virus was poised to bring the digital world to its knees. The potential catastrophe was beyond comprehension. Our digital lives, our data, our very way of existence were all at stake. As panic and fear gripped the world, a shadowy figure emerged from the depths of the internet. A person who would become the beacon of hope in this ominous situation. A hacker, but not the kind you're used to hearing about. This was a hacker with a different agenda. An agenda to safeguard the internet, to protect our digital lives, and to stop the impending catastrophe. This hacker was not looking for fame or fortune. He was driven by the sole purpose of saving the internet from the clutches of the Melissa virus. His identity was unknown. His actions, however, spoke volumes. He was the mysterious hero, the knight in digital armor, the one who dared to stand against the viral storm. You're about to hear the thrilling story of Marcus Hutchins, the man behind the mask. But before we dive in, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more captivating content. Stay tuned, because this is a story that will leave you on the edge of your seat. Marcus Hutchins, born and raised in the United Kingdom, was no ordinary child. Even in his early years, he exhibited a keen interest and an uncanny aptitude for the world of technology. Computers in particular fascinated him. The intricate dance of codes and commands, the delicate interplay of hardware and software. They spoke to him in a language he seemed to understand instinctively. As he grew older, his fascination only deepened. His parents' old computer became his playground, and the internet his wide, uncharted ocean. He would spend hours, days even, lost in the mesmerizing world of binary codes and algorithms. His curiosity was insatiable, his thirst for knowledge unquenchable. But what set Marcus apart from other tech-savvy kids of his age was his self-taught hacking skills. He was a natural, a prodigy. What began as innocent tinkering quickly escalated into more complex feats. He could dissect a piece of software, expose its vulnerabilities and fix them, all before breakfast. He could weave through firewalls and bypass security systems like a phantom. He was a shadow in the digital realm, unseen yet omnipresent. His hacking skills, however, were never used for malicious intent. On the contrary, he used his powers for good. He helped friends recover lost data, assisted local businesses in strengthening their digital security, and even aided the school's IT department in resolving complex issues. Marcus was just a teenager, but his skills and knowledge far surpassed those of many adult professionals in the field. His talents were not just impressive, they were extraordinary. And it was these skills, honed over years of dedicated practice and relentless curiosity, that would later play a crucial role in his heroic deeds. But this tech genius was destined for something bigger, something that would thrust him into the global spotlight. Little did he know then that he would soon become the unlikely saviour of the internet, the hero who would stop a digital disaster of unprecedented magnitude. In the digital realm, a storm was brewing, a dangerous virus known as Melissa. This wasn't just your typical malware. Melissa was a massive, fast-spreading macro virus that threatened to bring the world's computer systems to their knees. It was the late 90s, a time when the internet was still a fledgling concept and cybersecurity was a field yet to mature. The Melissa virus was born out of the darkest corners of the digital world, conceived by a man named David L. Smith. This was not a virus created for monetary gain or to steal information, but rather it was designed to spread chaos and disorder. 
It was a weapon of mass disruption. Melissa was a wolf in sheep's clothing. It disguised itself as an innocent email attachment, a list of passwords for various adult content websites. Once opened, the virus would infiltrate the user's email system, sending itself to the first 50 contacts in the address book. This made Melissa incredibly contagious, spreading like wildfire across networks and leaving a path of digital destruction in its wake. The virus was so aggressive that it quickly overloaded email servers worldwide. Major corporations like Microsoft and Intel had to shut down their email systems to halt the spread. The FBI and other international law enforcement agencies were on high alert. The world was facing a new kind of threat, one it wasn't prepared for. This was a digital pandemic, and it was spreading uncontrollably. The potential global damage of Melissa was colossal. It had the power to halt communication, disrupt businesses, and even compromise national security. The virus was not just a nuisance, it was a ticking time bomb, threatening to explode and shatter the digital world as we knew it. The world was on the brink of a digital catastrophe, and it needed a saviour. Little did anyone know that saviour would come in the unlikely form of a young, unassuming British hacker named Marcus Hutchins. From his small bedroom in the UK, Marcus Hutchins was about to change the world. In the face of a digital catastrophe, this unlikely hero was gearing up to face the challenge head-on. Hutchins, a self-taught computer whiz, set his sights on the menacing Melissa virus. With the internet's survival hanging in the balance, he embarked on what seemed like an impossible mission. Armed with his computer, Hutchins dived deep into the world of binary codes and algorithms. The virus was a complex beast, multiplying and mutating, leaving a trail of destruction in its wake. However, Hutchins was undeterred. He meticulously dissected the virus's code, studying its behavior, its patterns. He was in a race against time, trying to understand the virus before it could wreak further havoc. Being a hero isn't always about physical strength or valiant acts in the face of danger. Sometimes it's about determination, resilience, and a will to protect what matters. For Hutchins, it was the internet, the digital world he had grown to love and understand. His dedication was unwavering and his resolve was ironclad. Challenges were aplenty, but Hutchins wouldn't back down. He hit roadblocks, faced setbacks, but with each hurdle he only grew more determined. The virus was a formidable foe, but Hutchins was a formidable adversary too. He stayed up for nights on end, poring over lines of code, his eyes heavy with exhaustion, but his spirit unyielding. The world outside his small room may have been oblivious to his tireless efforts, but in the digital realm, Hutchins was a warrior battling a monstrous beast. As he delved deeper into the virus's intricacies, he began to see a glimmer of hope. He was getting closer to unraveling the virus's secrets, closer to putting a stop to the digital mayhem. Against all odds, Hutchins was closing in on the solution. The world held its breath. He was on the brink of a discovery that would change the course of internet history. The world was on the precipice of salvation, and it was all thanks to an unlikely hero named Marcus Hutchins. In a battle of codes and algorithms, Marcus Hutchins emerged victorious. A moment that would forever etch his name in the annals of cybersecurity history. But how did this young man with no formal training manage to halt a virus causing global chaos? Here's where the story gets interesting. Hutchins was not armed with a state-of-the-art lab or a team of experts, but rather a brilliant mind and a passion for understanding the inner workings of the digital world. He dived into the virus's code, meticulously dissecting its every function and command. He discovered that the Melissa virus was designed to propagate when a user opened a seemingly harmless document. Once activated, it would send itself to 50 email contacts from the user's address book, creating a domino effect of digital destruction. But within this destructive mechanism, Hutchins found a weakness. He noticed that the virus was programmed to connect to a specific domain, a sort of digital home base. If that domain was unreachable, the virus would cease its destructive behavior. It was a fail-safe, a kill switch, and Hutchins decided to activate it. In an audacious move, he purchased the domain the virus was attempting to connect to. With this action, he effectively took control of the virus's home base, rendering it harmless. The Melissa virus was stopped in its tracks. 
The world breathed a sigh of relief. The onslaught of the Melissa virus had ended thanks to the efforts of this unlikely hero. Hutchins' triumph was celebrated globally, with headlines lauding his actions. He was hailed as the young hero who saved the internet, a title that he humbly accepted. His victory was not only a triumph over a destructive virus, but also a testament to the power of curiosity, intelligence and resilience. It demonstrated that sometimes all it takes is one individual, one brilliant mind to make a world of difference. Marcus Hutchins, the unlikely hero, had saved the internet, but his story doesn't end there. After the storm had passed, Marcus Hutchins' life was forever changed. The young man, who had once been just another face in the crowd, was now a household name. His extraordinary feat of bravery and intellect had not only saved the world from a catastrophic cyber meltdown, but also revolutionized the way we perceive cybersecurity. The aftermath of Hutchins' victory over the Melissa virus was a whirlwind of emotions, accolades, and newfound responsibilities. The once anonymous hacker was now in the limelight and his life was transformed overnight. His story, a beacon of hope and resilience, resonated with millions around the globe. The media, once eager to demonize hackers, was now celebrating one as a hero. Marcus Hutchins became a symbol of a new age of cybersecurity, an age where the lines between good and evil, right and wrong, were blurred. His actions forced us to reconsider our preconceived notions about hackers and their potential role in safeguarding our digital world. In the world of cybersecurity, Hutchins' legacy is unparalleled. He single-handedly demonstrated the profound impact one individual can have in combating digital threats. His triumph over the Melissa virus was a testament to the power of human ingenuity and the indomitable spirit of perseverance. His story serves as a reminder that heroes come in all shapes and sizes, often from the most unexpected places. Today, Marcus Hutchins is not just remembered as the hacker who saved the internet. He is revered as a pioneer, a trailblazer who reshaped our understanding of cybersecurity. His story is not just one of victory over a malicious virus, but also of a battle against societal prejudices and stereotypes. In the world of ones and zeros, Marcus Hutchins emerged as a hero, proving that not all hackers are villains. Some, like him, are the guardians of our digital universe the unsung heroes who brave the shadows to keep our world safe. Marcus Hutchins, a name etched in the annals of cyber history. So that's the incredible story of Marcus Hutchins, the hacker who saved the internet. A tale as riveting as it is inspiring, a narrative steeped in the heart of our digital age. An age where a single line of code can either wreak havoc or save the day. Hutchins' story is one of resilience, courage and unflinching determination. A young man from the humble beginnings propelled into the global spotlight, not for causing chaos, but for preventing it. He single-handedly stopped the Melissa virus, a digital menace that threatened to bring the world to its knees. His actions serve as a stark reminder of the power of the internet and the magnitude of threats it can harbour. But more importantly, his story underscores the potential each one of us holds. That in the face of adversity, we all have the capacity to step up, to make a difference, to become heroes in our own right. Marcus Hutchins didn't just save the internet. He demonstrated the importance of internet safety, of vigilance in the face of potential threats. His story is a call to action, a plea for us all to take our digital lives as seriously as we do our physical ones. Because in the end, the internet is more than just a tool or a means of communication. It's a reflection of our society, an integral part of our lives. And it's up to us to protect it, to ensure its integrity for the generations to come. Marcus Hutchins' legacy is a testament to the power of individuals to make a difference. His story serves as a beacon, reminding us that in the vast expanse of the digital realm, heroes can emerge from the most unexpected places. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more fascinating stories. Remember, in the world of the internet, you never know who might be the next Marcus Hutchins.